medical dialogues your daily dose of health and medical news i'm mr zaman and today i'm going to talk about sudden cardiac arrest warning signs provide opportunity for prevention primary care visits rise sharply in the weeks immediately preceding a sudden cardiac arrest according to results from the escape net project Sudden cardiac arrest causes 1 in 5 deaths in industrialized countries. Most sudden cardiac arrests occur in the community in people not known to be at risk. A cardiac arrhythmia called ventricular fibrillation causes the heart to stop pumping and blood flow ceases. If blood flow is not restored quickly, the individual passes out and dies within 10 to 20 minutes. Escape net was set up to improve both prevention and treatment. During the 5-year scientific project which concludes on 1st January 2023, scientists have investigated the causes of ventricular fibrillation so that it can be prevented and have examined resuscitation strategies in an effort to improve survival rates. Developing effective prevention and treatment approaches required information on genetic and environmental risk factors from large study cohorts of sudden cardiac arrest patients which were previously unavailable. The 16 escape net scientific partners joined forces to create a shared harmonized database of more than 1 lakh sudden cardiac arrest victims. A biobank with DNA samples from 10,000 well phenotyped sudden cardiac arrest victims has also been created. Scientific discoveries include the finding that citizen rescuers provide less rapid resuscitation care to women than to men and that women consequently have lower survival chances than men. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe, and press the bell icon.